Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and first things first, oh, oh, sorry, this is Lumber Tycoon 2. First things first, my biggest apologies to Alex, Blue Elo, and Devil. I know you guys were jumping in there and you wanted to play with me and everything else, but after I loaded in, after everything got set up, I did this on like two different, um, two different servers and it's like I couldn't press E on anything. Ooh, it's Code Primate. Uh, so, like, I couldn't do this. The most simplest basic movement is to move something. And it just was not there. So, I'll have to, like, figure out what was happening. I think it might have just been lag, but hopefully, hopefully it was just lag. And we will try and fix that. Um, not computer lag, but, like, server lag. Roblox lag. Uh, oh gosh, I'm stuck. Okay, so where we left off last time, I've got the doors evened up. They are now ready to go. Uh, let's get this out of the walkway because people tend to get stuck on it for some reason. Let's, let's stick you down there. That's good. Uh, I set up this system. I don't know if I showed this to you guys last night or not, but it actually moves all the doors at one time, gets them out of the way for me. I, I don't remember. I don't even remember what I did this morning. So, And that's okay. And jump back over. Just keep in, I'm just gonna keep on with the doors, talk to you guys for a little bit, and uh, do more building off uh, off camera so I can try and get these things done for you. Because, I mean, that's mostly the reason that I build. Like, I don't need gold wood. I could go get some if I wanted to, but the reason I do the builds is because it gives me a challenge, gives me a task to do, and because it looks amazing. So, now let's flip the doors up. We're gonna go up the middle one, like that. And this is the coolest discovery ever. The, the handles, that's the best. Move, B. By the way, um, thank you for the comment of why the moves were messing up. If you move a door, then the game auto saves. That's what messes up the placement of things. And I'm not just moving one thing, I'm moving six things at one time, so the chances of me moving something during the middle of an autosave are higher than that of like just regular plain, regular building. There we go. Okay, cool. Um, also, huge shout out to everyone that joined me in the streams tonight. Um, if you didn't watch the Pokemon Brick Bronze video, which by the way, that released the same time as this one, um, then you will know that I'm doing live stream of Roblox Lua scripting and it's not going to be a game it's just going to be models and things that I create that I find interesting that I want to try and the main reason for that is so I can get better at my scripting so the stream for you guys is all about me <laughs> sorry that sounded wrong no um, it's so you guys can see scripting like at work um, it does take a lot of effort to script things so when you see those free scripts like the the Coles admin script and stuff like that. That's great, but if you don't understand what the script is doing, then like I find it dangerous because they could sneak in admin commands that allow them to take over your game. So you gotta be careful. Why is this not going up there? Rotate, rotate. Am I too far away? I might be too far away. Maybe, maybe not. Come on, just just go up. Okay, let's place you down here first, and now, right, come back. Oh no, there, sweet. These are getting up there, aren't they? Uh, oh no, I don't want to move. I want to hit the switch. There we go. So, what I might do next is uh, I'll make a platform up here for myself, and then I'll move this thing of doors upwards. Ooh, how am I gonna do the, the switch at the bottom? Hmm. That's okay. Move, B. Move, B. Move, B. By the way, Defaultio, if you're watching, um, how about a remote switch? Something that you can set down and then it asks you, okay, what would you like to activate? And you place something down idea it's a thought it could be useful just saying okay 
So now that those are in place, let's get a platform up there. Can I move that? Move this. Oh, how am I going to grab the other ones? Oh, man. Silly code. Why did you forget to put a platform down there? Rotate turn. Let's place it right there. And that's a small area to hit. Oh, I got it. I nailed it. Awesome. Uh, let's just do a turn on this one. Place that right there. We're going to do move here. And place that one right there. By the way, this is uh, floating jumps, I guess. Whoa, no! Oh, seriously? i got to climb up the whole thing. Again. I was just trying to jump on the little wall. That way I could move the one that was right below me and then just keep moving up. Maybe I just need to take it easy. Take it easy moving up. That's what I need to do. So, uh, for those of you that are experiencing the hurricane right now, why are you watching YouTube? Um, but if you are in the middle of the storm, then I hope my video can bring you a little bit of comfort during a time of, of scariness. And it is scary. It is very scary. And I want you to know that we're all thinking about you, and we hope that you're okay. Um, hang, in, hang in there. Hang tight. Because it... It doesn't take too long for it to move around. Uh, let's do a turn. Let's just go up slowly. Nice and easy. One at a time. There we go. And two. And if you want to comment about it or say something to, um, to the people who are being affected by it right now, Feel free to do that down in the comments if you want. Just let them know that you're thinking about them. Anybody that's out there. Anybody affected. And our thoughts are with them. Do -do 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 -do. Keep building, keep building. Just keep building, just keep building, just keep building, building. By the way, uh, if you've not seen the t-shirt, there is a new t-shirt that Savage created that is uh, Doors for Code, and it now fits the, they've, they've got one that fits the block avatar, and one that fits the formed avatar. What do I mean? The uh, blocked avatar does not have the uh, muscular arms like I do. Uh, the blocked avatar is just uh, literally blocks. They kind of look like... Um, Lumber Tech and two pieces have just been thrown together. Um, I don't know the original uh, avatars. I was not around during that time. So, yeah, that's good. I, th I think I, I can grab that last piece, so it'll be fine. And let's go right here. Hold on. Can I get it up there? Oh, geez. Oh gosh. Mm. That looks good, I think. Let's do that with the last two platforms. Let's just put them side by side. That way I've got a place to stage the doors and aim from. Uh, I'll get them evened out when I get up there. Uh, I'm going to have to extend that wire up there to a switch, aren't I? Oh gosh. So. Let's go grab some more wires while we're thinking about it. Okay, that should be good. Uh, then I can move the doors up, and that'll be the next section that we'll start playing with. Uh, boom. By the way, um, who is it? Def Griffin? Definitely Griffin or something like that? Um, thank you for your comment during the... the oh gosh, I don't want to move that. Hit B. Uh, during the last one where I couldn't play, um, he says, man, you've got a tall base. That is a tall tower. And he's like, really impressed with it. I'm like, thank you. That's awesome. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I need it right next to the edge. So let's go right there. Finish. Oh, I'm lifting a leg. What is my avatar doing? Slow motion. Okay. And I am going to break this down. Like, it was fun, but I need wires. Alright, and let's go here. Finished. 
and one more here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did I take it? Okay, I took it. And right there. Finished. And we'll need one more switch. We'll just make switches all up the thing. I might move them when I'm done. I might just leave them there. Leave them in place. Who knows? It's all up in the air at the moment. There we go. Okay, cool. Oh, man. It's been a very long day. I uh, spent most of my day programming. So uh, that's what I do for my job, is I'm a computer programmer. And specialties, like the current languages that I'm using, which are not limited to, are Cold Fusion. Um, let's see. Cold Fusion, HTML, Java, no, no, JavaScript, uh, jQuery, SQL, uh, a little bit of CSS here and there, but literally it's like five different languages on one page. It's very confusing sometimes. All right, so I'm going to have to move the lever up there first, right? Yes. Yes, I will. No, I, I want to place it up here on the thing. Okay, let's just go up this direction. That way I can place it on that first platform. And let's go rotate, rotate, rotate. Like that. Is that how I want it? No, that's not how I wanted it. Let's move this off to the side so I can climb up all the way. There we are. Doop, 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 doop. I want you facing the other direction, sir. But I'm actually going to place this down first. So I need an area to actually climb up, so we're going to leave a little bit of gap right there. Same thing on the opposite side. A little bit of gap right there. And now I can move these. You No, you're... No. Okay, we can just move it. That's cool. Rotate, rotate. You're going to be hanging off the side because I need that wire right there. You are going to move over there. You are going to move right here. This is so great not having to use ladders. Just saying. Wait. I need these actually in place of right there because those are my markers. There we go. Okay. So now we need to place the wire attached from down there up to here. <laughs> Move. So let's go right here. Are we going to be able to attach it? Oh, I don't know if the connection is going to work. Uh, let's check the connection first. Just double check. Yeah, it works. Okay, so let's go move right here to right here. That way it's on the side and not on it exactly. Finished. Oh, that is not a long distance. I might need more than, than that. Okay. Whoa, right on the edge. I'm on the edge of lumber. Oh, gosh. I wanted to do this with the, uh, the palm bridge. Oh, gosh. Like, put a wire on it. How far can it go? How far can it go? Right to there. Finished. And next up. I still got one wire down there. Nice. Move. That's the one that glitched out the other day when we were doing uh, the moves and it auto saved on us. Ha ha ha. I found it. Okay. Let's go right here. Now we're going to climb, 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 climb. Oh gosh. Oh golly. We're really not... Okay, I'm, I'm glad I've got one more. Did not want to have to jump all the way back down to do that. Move. Okay. And... Landed it. Landed it. 
here. Please work. Perfect. Sweet. Okay. Uh, let's move this out of the way for just a moment. Move. Put you over here. Climb up. And test. Here we go. <laughs> yes! Yes! That is awesome. That is awesome. I'm the bridge keeper. <laughs> okay, we gotta keep that down for just a second. Let's go here. Um, let's go move. We're gonna move all these just underneath on the doors. Move. Well, not all of them. Maybe some of them. Oh. Oh no, do I have to do that thing where I look down and up? Oh, I hope I don't have to do that the whole time. Oh, it's so annoying. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, it's close enough. Close. Alright, there we are. I don't, because there's ground back there. Technically, the mountain is ground, so... I can just look at the mountain. The bear went over the mountain to see what he could see. Uh-oh, did I just open a door? <laughs> okay, hold on. Click. Oh, there's an open door right there, too. Uh-oh, closed door, open door. Okay, let's just move this door right here. There we go. Okay, now we can close the door. There we are. It was stuck to another door. Oh, so many doors. Doors, 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 doors. Doors for we got doors for days. Another big shout out to all the contestants and all the people that did the competition for the doors for code. That was awesome. Like I didn't I didn't realize. I know, like I had a hint that you guys were making doors, but I had no clue it was that many. So many doors. Come on. There we are. Oh, wait. Am I going to be able to build from that side? Yeah, I should be fine. Let's, um... Let's test out our theory here in just a second. Because I don't think I'm going to be able to get all these doors on those three little platforms. Move, 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 move. Land of bear, land of blessing. Oh man, let's go right here. This is, the, um, the, yeah, I'm not talking at all, am I? Um, if you guys, I know there's been a couple that have already posted that they've done the, the gold bridge. If you've already done a gold bridge or if you have some other kind of bridge, take a picture of it and send it to me on, uh, on either Snapchat or on um, uh, Twitter, like at me at Twitter. I would love to see your guys' uh, creations. Um, also, if you'd like me to see your base, take pictures of it. I want to see. All right, let's jump. Okay. So let's go ahead and put this back, and I'm just going to see how well this works. There's that. Okay. Lower the doors. Move. We need to set it on its side, so... Uh, rotate. Turn. Turn, turn. Rotate. Ah, yes, perfect. So, this is actually going to be very effective. Hold on. Why is that? There we go. No, nope, I'm probably going to have to build from the from the opposite side. So, let's close. Now I can just Move, a B, a move, a B, and a move. Come on, move, 
MB. Sweet. Move the tiny floors. Building up our gold bridges. Uh oh, that was wrong. Needs to be on the left side of the cylinder. It doesn't need to be, you just have to have it in line. And as long as I'm doing it consistent, consistent, consistently every time, then it should be good. And again, I am I do apologize about playing on private server. I don't feel right about it, but it's also the only uh oh why? What happened? Move. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What in the world? Open. No. Hmm. Reload? Possibly reload? Might have auto saved during the uh, thing. Alright, let's go menu, load. Current save, five minutes ago. Done. <clears throat> this will only take five minutes. That'll be an entire video. So, <laughs> the title of today's video Code Loads His Base. <laughs> and that's it. That's the whole video. It's just. Start at the, the minute mark and then 30 minutes later. All right, my base just got loaded in. Thanks for joining me tonight. <laughs> no code. Also, there was a lot of people that said, oh no, I missed it to the, uh, the live stream. If you miss it, it is recorded. So don't worry about it too much. If, you're, if you show up late, don't worry about it. You're, you're there. I mean, you're still viewing it, so. I record and archive all my live streams, so you guys can watch them at your convenience for your viewing pleasure. What was really kind of weird was um, I casted it to you now, and from you now it actually casted it to YouTube. So there was two live streams going on at one time. Um, I had two YouTube live streams, one you now live stream and a Twitch live stream. Crazy. So, I'll have to figure out how to stop that. Maybe what I'll do is I'll just, I will uh, remove the YouTube from the restream and just do the you now since it sends it to YouTube and then that way I can manipulate them at the end. Because it uploaded two videos, one from you now and one from YouTube. So, it's the exact same video. I felt bad. I couldn't bring myself to actually delete one of them because there were two different sets of views. There was like 300 views on the first one and then 500 views on the second one and they were from different people. So the analytics would be all messed up. I don't know how to combine the analytics of two videos and be like, this was actually just one video. But if you guys know how to do that, um, comment down below. It's all about the comments. No code, you're wrong. It's not about the comments. You're right, you're right. It's about the money. No, no code, it's wrong. Oh, is that, is that wrong too? Um, is it about the views? No code, what are you talking about? Oh, is it about the gameplay? Yes, partly code. Partly. Oh, okay, okay, so it's all about the gameplay. That's that's what it is, it's about the gameplay. What about the fans? Oh, and the fans, and it's definitely the fans, right? Definitely the fans and the gameplay. I do it for you guys and for the gameplay. Even if, like, somebody asked me the other day, um, how many subs you up to? I'm like, it doesn't really matter. It, it truly doesn't. I would still be recording for you guys. All right, what has happened to that top one? I should just destroy that door. Oh no, oh no, oh no. The game is messing up like before. Could it be possible that the wire is messing it up? No, the wire is not close enough. Could it be possible that it's the yellow wood messing it up? Could it be possible that I've turned this the wrong direction? Uh, rotate, rotate. No, because I did it to all three doors and it didn't have a problem. So, what's next? What's next? Next. Whoa, 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 whoa. I did notice that these set of doors are offset by like a fraction of a stud. 
So I wonder if that has something to do with it. Let's go ahead and lower them all back down. We're going to move you back in place. Right here you go. There. And now let's pull these back up. Oh, that was way off. Oh, that's because it's not the bright. <laughs> all right, lower you back down. Move you back out of place. Come here, you. Raise it back up. We need to move this down to here. And we're going to the left-hand side. Open that back up. Move this one. Here we go. And efficiency. Come on. Good. Now raise the doors. Move and replace. Open the doors. No. Why? If anybody can figure out why this door like that particular happens, please let me know in the comments because I've experimented and it looked fine. It looks fine. Um, let's continue on with the other doors. How much time do I have? I still have like four minutes of door building to do. So we're going to just leave this one in place for the time being. Hopefully it gets corrected or fixes itself. And I don't know why it's offset like that. That's crazy. All right, let's go back up. Let's move this one. Come here, you. Come on. I'll check the doors on the way back down as well. Make sure they're all closed. Don't want to have any open doors. <laughs> it's, a, it's an open door policy. Get it? Open door policy. Never mind. Um, my boss has an open door policy. You can come talk to me anytime. Cool. I'll do that. And I do. Whenever I need something, or whenever he needs something, open communication, which is really cool. Like, I've got one of the coolest bosses ever. So. If, uh, if my boss is listening, thank you. I think you're amazing. He hired me like seven years ago. Oh, now they're all broken. Great. Just what I needed. That's exactly what I was planning on. I mean, that was perfect. Hmm. Well, now they're all broke. <laughs> well, let's, let, let's leave it there for the time being. And yeah. Oh, I'll get them figured out. Thank you all for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, follow, tweet, um, become a fan on you now and YouTube and Twitch and Twitter and Instagram and Snapchat and just think of it like if it's a social network, just search for Code Primate. That's probably me. If it's on Xbox, it's going to be Mr. Code Primate. But I'm tied to a lot of things, so do them all, and uh, it's your choice. You don't have to. It's just something I'm supposed to call at the end. And I will remind you of that every video. Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you very soon. Bye. Thank you.